I'm short of breath. Do you want to check my pulse? I will sue you. Listen, darling. Don't put your hands on me. You're playing with my ass. You know I'm not a shit stupid woman. I have a brain tumor. On May 7th, 2024. Officers responded to a hotel following a report of a woman making threats and refusing to leave the property with her dog. Hey, how's it going? What's going on? So we have this, we have 2.30, 31. Yeah, she's a uh, female dog. She's a bit of a weird guest. Uh, when she came to make a reservation last week, she was rude to the person in the front. Yeah, we still made her reservation. She said she was having a bad day. We understood. About three days later, she comes back here, an Uber driver drops her off, and she calls you guys again uh, because he's, she said she didn't have a ride and somebody just dropped her off here. But the Uber driver dropped her off here because he, she was started yelling at him. She was like, you're so incompetent, this and that. So my manager went out and she was like, what's going on? And the lady was like, well, they left me here. And my manager told the officer and her, well, if you were speaking to me the way you spoke to him, I would have done the same thing. She came to check in yesterday. Uh, I asked her for her ID because that's we always verify IDs. She's like, why do I have that? Why do I need to show you my ID? I'm right here. I'm present. I showed it when I got here. I was like, ma'am, it's just policy. Uh, she came down this morning. Wi-Fi problems. I was trying to help her out. Uh, not even a minute went by. And she started yelling at me, stressing out. She's like, I'm paying for a free Wi-Fi and you're not giving it to me. I was like, ma'am, don't yell at me. I'm trying to help you. She's like. Oh, I've been trying to get this for 30 minutes to work. I was like, man, I'm trying to help you. You're yelling at me. That's not going to work if you keep yelling at me. She grabbed all her stuff and she, she went to her room. The housekeepers went to go knock right now to do service. Uh, she has a dog and the, she opened the door. So the dog ran out. One of our housekeepers kind of got scared. She moved out of the way. So then she comes out and grabs her dog. And since our housekeepers don't really understand uh, English, don't communicate English with her that well, uh, she called the, the housekeeping manager to see what's going on. When my housekeeping manager gets there, the lady's yelling at her. She's like, you guys are not letting me into my room, this and that. So then my, she's like, I'm calling the cops. So my, ma my housekeeping manager came down. She's like, hey, I guess it's upset. We don't know why. I go up there. She was on the phone with you guys. And then out of the nowhere, I asked her, what's the problem now? I can't get back into my room. And you guys locked me out. And I was like, whoa. I was like, I just got here. What's going on? She's like, and don't yell at me again. And then she was like, well, you guys are not letting me in. And then my housekeeper manager tried to explain to me in Spanish what the other housekeeper said, and she cussed her out. She was like, don't be talking to, to, about me in Spanish, this and that. And I told her, ma'am, you can't be talking to us like that. I'm gonna ask you to leave. And then she's saying, oh, the, I'm really scared now. They're, they're acting like I'm doing something bad. So I'm like, I just, we don't want her here anymore. Uh, and she doesn't want to leave because when I called her earlier to tell her she needs to leave, she's like, that's not happening. I'm not leaving. Is she back in her room? Yeah, she's back in her room. Okay. Let me wait for the other officer and then we'll go ask her to leave. Oh, uh, 2 30. How much time does she have left? Oh, uh, she, well, she checked out today or did uh, she pay no, for she, a whole week? Well, she originally was here for three nights, but yesterday she, she checked in again. Yeah, she checked in yesterday. And then uh, this morning I told her, if you keep talking to us like that, I will ask you to leave. And then, yeah, start, uh, shortly she did it again to the housekeepers. What's her reservation for now? Uh, just for tonight. Just for tonight? Yeah. Yeah, she, I have her checking now today. What's her name? Uh, hey. Sarah, hi. Sarah? Santa Fe Police Department. How's it going, Miss Hyde? Depends. Which side are you on? I don't know what that means. Uh, but here's the deal, okay? So I spoke with the guy downstairs. Um, and then I read the information that you provided to dispatch about them letting your dog out. Um, regardless of what occurred, whether you believe they were rude or they believed that you were rude, okay, we're not really here to dispute any of that. I didn't, I'm sorry. I did not let my dog out on purpose. That was an accident. Okay, I need you. You need to open the door. You need to open the door. I'm not going to open the door. Sorry. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm short breath now. I'm just standing up. Hello? 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 Do you want to go to jail? But right now I am short of breath and I can't 
can't move. So I need to rest a bit. So give me 15 minutes, okay? Do you need an ambulance? They don't get treated this way. Miss Hine, this is the Santa Fe Police Department, Officer Romero. You have to open the door, okay? You're getting very close to a point where you're going to be placed under arrest if you do not open this door. King 22571. Miss Hine, you need to leave the premises now. If you don't open this door, you're going to jail. I'm telling you right now. If you do. I'm getting ready. I asked you to bring my stuff. If you can't bring it, I'm not opening the door. Bring what stuff? What? Not what I'm going through, what I'm doing is not going to jail. So let me explain something to you, okay? If you leave on your own free will, you open this door and we walk with you outside. I am calling for somebody to take me to another place. I am short of breath. I have chest pain. Okay, move. you can still open the door. You guys will have to lift for a while. Miss Hine, you need to open the door. You're going to be placed under arrest. I have the right to privacy right now. I have asked for the dolly to take my stuff downstairs. Once I'm packed and my stuff is downstairs, then I'm gone. You don't have to deal with me again. How much time do you need to pack? Honey, I'm still working on it. I told you, I'm short of breath. I have a brain. Okay. Out. I can't shake. I'm on bad medicine. I get short of breath. I hear that, but you need to open the door. No, I'm not opening the door until I'm already. You put that thing back up here. Don't pack me. Let's get going, okay? When I'm done packing. See, I'm not done packing. Can we open the door? Would you let the dog back in? That's stupid to let him out. Come here, Snyder. He's not out. The door's Snyder. closed. Snyder, come here. Come here. I'm sorry. This is... Bring me the stuff that I can put my it's stuff... It's right there. Is it? Okay, can you bring it in? I'm it's short of breath. Do you want to check my pulse? I don't need to check your pulse. If you need an you ambulance, don't care I can to call. Check my pulse. I can call an ambulance. I'm not a medical professional, but I can call an ambulance for you. I have been treated very cruelly okay. and rudely. Finish packing so. your stuff, please, so we can I get can't one. I can't because I'm short of breath. If you don't pack your stuff, then I'll pack your stuff and I'll call an ambulance for you. Those are your only options. That is not the only option. Those are the only options. Those are not the only so options. So I can call you an ambulance. They can check on you. Well, they're checking on you. I can pack your stuff for you. No, you're not touching my stuff. Then you need to leave and pack it I'm yourself. I'm trying. I have been working my So go ahead and start packing. Not right now. I'm taking a short breath because my pulse ox is low. Okay. Snyder, we'll get, come here. Come we'll here. get you an ambulance and I'll pack your stuff for Snyder, you. Snyder, come here. How old are you, ma'am, so I could get you an ambulance? None of your business. Snyder, come on. If you refuse to leave, I'm telling you, you're going to I'm go not to refusing to leave. You I'm refusing to finish packing right okay. now because I'm I'll pack I'm your short. stuff for you then. No, you will not. Don't. Come close Do to me. Do not touch my I stuff. Will stuff. I will you. sue you. You can sue me if you want, but we need to get going. Do you understand how sick I, tell I am? You, I can call you an ambulance, but we need you to leave the property, okay? This you is know, do you know how grateful that makes me feel in Santa Fe? Listen, ma'am, I don't want to fight with you. I don't want to argue with you. I have I've a job to do. i with my person. Listen to me. Okay, fine. I have a job to do, okay? Uh, that's your they job. They no longer want you on the property, you... so I have to ask you to leave, okay? They've asked you to leave multiple times. You have to leave their property. I, as I was getting ready to get them something nice and say I'm really sorry because there is stuff, there's medicine I'm I taking you. in I my brain. And I was going to say I'm sorry. Listen, the, 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 listen darling. Don't put your hands on me. Okay? It's gentle. I'm gentle. It's, it's okay. Touch I'm being it's very I had the, the waitress okay. knocked at my door. I opened the door. The dog ran out, ran into the room. I got locked out for 20 minutes. Okay. They left I'm, me listen, locked out. I hear you. Okay. For 20 minutes, which is And I'm sorry that you feel that, that they were rude to you, okay. but they need you to leave. Excuse me. I would like my purse. Thank you. There's no reason for you to be so aggressive. There I'm is a reason for me to be aggressive, and they've been nothing but mean to me. I need you to pack your stuff. I need to rest until my pulse goes back down. Okay. This can take five minutes. Why didn't you guys go back downstairs? I'll be out. I'll pack your stuff. I'm not going to stay. I'm not going to poop in the room. Please do not touch my stuff. I will pack it for you. Please do not. Unfortunately, touch. we can't wait. If you ha have a medical emergency, I can call an ambulance for you. Okay? But if if you do not have a medical emergency, you need to leave. It okay. is a medical emergency, okay. and it's we'll different. call you an ambulance. It's not an ambulance needed. I needed to get over to Zaya. Okay. 
to the rest so place where they're going to fry my brain. We need to pack your stuff, okay? Okay, can we wait two minutes until I get my... Sh We've been waiting, so I'll pack your stuff for you. What else do you need to, that needs to go? Don't touch my stuff. You don't know where it's going. Stop. Let go of me, you Stop. Let go of me. Stop. I'm trying to pack this for you. You're under arrest. No, I am not. Yes, you are. No, I am not. You tried biting me? You threw a phone at my officer? That is illegal. You do not do that. Please, would you please nope, let me go? Like, you do not do that. Can I have my phone? No. I'm sorry you feel I'm really offensive. I was trying really hard not to be offensive. Ma'am, you grabbed my face and I, I touched your face regardless, gently. Regardless. Okay? Well, I'm sorry I touched you. And I let it go. Okay? But you continue to but be he, difficult. No. I'm not trying to be difficult. I'm trying to get out of here and it upsets me more. Please let my wrists go. I promise I will. I will. Finish. Somebody can pick up my dog. Who? So whoever gets my Umer, I'm not going to jail. You are going to jail. I am not time. going to jail. Look, I, I'm a really... I have no reason to be in jail. It's, I don't want your dog to go to animal control. Or to my dog's not going to animal control. I'm going to Z. I'm going to get my brain fried. Please let me go. I promise I will be very, very, very nice. I will get out of this. I will never, ever look at this place again. I try to apologize for how I behave. This is unconscionable. If you knew who I am and what I have done and what I am going through, it's been very rude for these people. Can you hear me out? I will listen to you. Okay. I've been nothing but nice to you. You have been nothing but nice to me. Okay. Yes, you have. I Even did not slap you. I touched you. Regardless, okay? You still grabbed me, okay? I did not grab listen. you. I touched you. Listen. There's a difference. I didn't want things to escalate, so I didn't do anything at that point, okay? All I did was ask you to pack. I'm Mul packing. Listen to me. You said you were going to hear me out, right? I asked you multiple times to pack, okay? You said, oh, I need to catch my breath. I, I said, do. okay, we'll get you I an ambulance. I need to catch my breath. Okay? Uh, let let me out. So me. I, you know, it's been 15 minutes. If you let me out of my things and get me, I will go sit on the... Are you going to listen to me? I'm listening. Okay. Are you listening to me? I am, but you need You're to listen to me first, to me. and then I will listen to you. Okay. Your actions today, okay, you can't throw stuff at me. You can't grab me by the I face. I didn't throw anything at you. you I just grabbed your face. I touched you. You grabbed me with both hands of the face. I touched Listen you. to me. There's All a I'm saying is. Touch and grab. Please just Describe let me go. Okay. All I need is. But your actions today are they're not reasonable. Well, they're not reasonable because my brain's not reasonable, and I totally admit that. Okay. And it's not my fault, and it pisses me off. She didn't and actually bite you, did she? She tried. She grabbed me I did, me not. Somewhere I down did here. not. Felt the pinch. I did not. I wouldn't touch his. I don't need one. Listen real quick, okay? We've we've already gone to this, okay? Like we both agreed, I've been nothing but respectful to you, okay? I've been trying very hard. Yes. I have. All but I'm asking, please take. I'm going to tell you again, okay? I don't know what kind of interactions you've had with police officers, okay? But you can't grab me by the face, okay? I and you and I let that go. Okay, I all I did was ask you to leave, and I still okay. tried to work with you. I will not touch any of okay. anybody else. Just please let me don't my stuff. But unfortunately, on the unfortunately, we're we're past that point. Okay, so you are going to be placed under arrest. No, I'm not. You will find out from the people that's not a question, the reason that's going on. I'm their supervisor. I'm Sergeant Montiel with the Santa Fe Police Department. Okay, I'm the shift commander. Can I call? No. Can I call Zia and say I'm on? Based I'm on the going. crimes you committed, you're going to jail. <laughs> Okay. Unreasonable. Yes, you are. Are you the manager, Mr. Yes. Yeah. Okay. You want to sit up? I want, my, I want this off. Unfortunately, they're, they're not coming off. It is affecting my medication. I need it off. I'm not going to be mean anymore, I promise. If you want me sitting in the damn police car, you can take me. I will find somebody yeah. to come and get Schneider. Just go check in the restaurant. Your pants look funny. Your pants aren't torn or anything. I didn't touch his damn Yeah, she's not being very helpful with us. Oh. Hey, miss. Did she yell at her? I can hear you. Did, I'm not Did she okay. yell at her? I'm in. When we were here? I would like no. my 
Um, was she the one that she yelled at, or she yelled at another housekeeper? It was another housekeeper, right? Where was Flip the park? Okay. 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 Are, are you okay? Can you see an ID? Can you pass me a No, I hear you. I hear you. I promise I will not touch anybody. I will pack my stuff. I will leave this place. And I will not bother anybody here ever, ever, ever again. Thanks, guys. Do you think you guess what, Matt? Uh, Matt said it. Seven. Thank you. All right, best of luck, Miss. I'm going to send one of you guys' wives a note about how well I was taken care of. You're not going to get a girl? I'm assuming no. If you sit up, I can fix those for you. I cannot sit up. I'm they sorry. Can you roll over? We'll send you up and I'll fix them. the restraints on you. Can you reach down? I can't get up. I'm old. I don't have this. I have bruises all over my body. That hurt. No, that hurts. Okay, we have to stand you up regardless. I don't have to. Please, no. I don't have to. Please undo it. I'll lift it up. Just lift it up and then I'll get up. It'll right. work that way. The faster we get you up, the faster we get you it out of here. It hurts too <laughs> but You know why you put it on there, right? What you did, you can't be doing that. I did not do anything. Okay, so we're going to help you up slowly. The medic said you're fine. Don't, so please they don't left. pull on me. We have to send you up. Please don't pull on me. We have to send you up. Please okay? don't pull on me. Please try way. to be gentle. The easiest way is if they sit you on your bottom and then we help you up. That way they're not pulling on your arm. It you is pulling on my arm, sir. So you got to cooperate. I'm trying. You're not Roll you on your side. I need you to kick your feet under you so I can, so you can stand up. I'm still going to hurt. It's going to hurt a little bit. It's hurting a lot right now. Ma'am, Miss High, you're under arrest, okay? Those handcuffs are not coming off. So work with us the best way possible. Now, if the handcuffs okay. are coming off, I'm not moving. Unfortunately, That's... they're not coming off, ma'am. So I'm going to be very honest with you, okay? You, We're going to ask that you go willingly on your own, okay? I would ask nicely I'm going to be tell you straight up what's going to happen, okay? If you do not go on your own, you're still going, but we will force you to get up and, and go to our vehicle. Okay. So I'm I asking... swear to God promise i will not touch you please and i know you can bend over undo this you're, i will stand up gently and then arrest. you can put yeah, the damn thing back on you're under arrest okay we're not taking those off okay fine just just bruise me yeah. bruise yeah. get out we don't want to hurt you i'm just trying to hurt you break, break all my break all my clothes oh. so just sit up okay. there you go there you go stand up one we're gonna help you off two, your feet three three there you go here's, you want to put these here's, on? here's your shoes let go let go of me I need to finish packing my stuff so That's, I have my so stuff. Unfortunately, we gave you a chance and you declined that, so now we get to pack your stuff. I declined that because I was short of breath. There are plenty of breath to argue and fight with these guys. Put on your shoes. No, I'm not. Okay, then you can go barefoot. That's no, I'm not. Up. No. It's not a question, man. You're going to walk down to the car one way or another. Can I get my purse? I'll try to it. It's on the bed. Please be nice to my dog. He's gentle. The sergeant's still in there. Oh, yeah, I asked for that like 20 minutes ago. No, I asked I, because I was not physically able to get off the floor. These tight things. I'm going, you're going to find that I have bruises all over my body from what's going on, and now it's worse. I did not hit you. I touched you gently. And you're buying that I hit you, and I think that's wrong. I, I taught my own oh, Jesus. I did not pinch him. That's what you guys are saying. I'm sorry, I can't do that. You have no choice, ma'am. I, but it hurts. So can I slow down a little bit so it doesn't of hurt? Take your time. The best way is to slide more in that way. If I didn't have a fat ass, maybe I wouldn't slide. Would slide easier, wouldn't I? Maybe if I had shorter legs. God damn it, I can't. It hurts. I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> I was not a horrible person. I cannot believe this. I can't, I'm sorry, I can't move. Quit playing with my ass. Get your hand off my ass. If you're gonna be a seatbelt, get your hand off my ass. If you're gonna be rude to me, I'll be rude back. We're gonna bring you your purse and your shoes and I have your cell phone, okay, Miss Thank Hine? you, I appreciate it. So that. real quick, Miss Hine, you do have some belongings here, okay? I just have to make you aware that your belongings are gonna stay here when you do come to pick them no. up when you get out of jail. You have to give us a call 
and we can come and stand can by you with you. Can you come and help me, stuff. please? I asked yesterday when I came down from Taos if I could just drop them off. It took me two hours to get from treatment at 3 o'clock to 5 o'clock here to check in because they wouldn't let me check my stuff. I have been nice. I've been walking my dog. I've been picking up his stuff. I've been quiet. And now this is... I asked for juice this morning. She goes, oh, there's no juice. It, I have been treated more rudely than ever, and now I'm the one who's bearing the thing, and they get to live with it. I was getting ready to... All my stuff goes into that one place. Listen, you're, you're, you're not getting arrested because of how you were treated or how you felt. You're getting arrested because of the things that you did when we asked you to leave, okay? I asked nicely to not leave, and I was not given options. Unfortunately, when they ask you to leave, you have to leave, okay? And then your actions after that are just unacceptable. Okay. Could we just get here so I can take this off? I am in yeah. pain. Give us a second, okay? We're getting your stuff now. We're going to get you some shoes and stuff, okay? Your cell phone's in my front seat. Not your cell phone. It's right in front of you, right in front of you. So what cell phone do I have? Yeah. Sweetheart, it's called. I don't know what you're saying, though, but I'm going to search your stuff. It's it's that. You have your hand on it right now. The, 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 see, I can't even say the words. The, 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 that. Right? You had your hand on it. Not the... Yeah, no. The, oh, okay. the, Regardless, the I got The glasses. It. The glasses. Are my, are my glasses in there? Yeah. Thank you. That's what I'm wanting is my glasses on my face. Well, you're saying phone. Well, I'm sorry, honey. That's the brain death thing that's going on. So in here, you have $100? Yes. Okay. Do you have any more money? No. I just have my debit. What do you have in here, ma'am? What? That is when you go in to give people CPR. I am a health care person. I have an emergency... Are you saying a mask? A mask, yes, to give people treatment. I have done that to ill people. <laughs> Please let me go. Put it in the front. I promise I won't hurt people. It hurts so bad. I have some shoes for you. I'm going to put your stuff back in here. And then I'm going to put it in the front seat with me, okay? What's your telephone number? Not telling. So the, the, the reason that we're asking is that way Animal Control can call you when, when you get out. You can go pick up your dog. 719. I appreciate that. It hurts me too hard to move around. Can you undo it, please? What's up? Can you undo the wrist, please, so I can move? Unfortunately, we can't until we get inside. Okay? Can you hold my shoulders, please? Okay. Just touch me so I. Okay. No, don't push. Let me stand up. Trying. I'm really trying. Okay. You know, I'm not a sh stupid sh woman. I believe that. <laughs> we all do, because we all commit mistakes. I don't know what you're going through in life right now. I can't imagine. A brain it. tumor. I'm dying. I'm sure Is that right. all? Where do I go? This way. Over here. Have a seat, Miss. No, I, I want my wrist off. It hurts me. It's physically hurt. I have breathing problems and I have bruising and I cannot see. We sit can put down. two sets of cuffs on. You can put you can undo these and then put them in front. And I will be half much happier and you will be much happier and it will be more comfortable. But it will happen right now, please. I ask nicely, several times. You can you can glue each of my arms to one of the labels. I just can't have them behind me, sir. It's not physically able. Well unfortunately they are gonna be behind you, okay? They will not be behind me. You, you will put one here and one here. My wrist will be in front. I'm not, you're not moving my wrist. They hurt too bad right now. I am in pain, and I will not move until I. Once he gets back, we'll make a determination. What we're okay, you, okay, you keep a determination. I really. I am not a terrible person, and I did not slap you. I didn't I say touched that you slapped you me. Yes, I you did. You, yeah, I touched you. I said that you grabbed me. Did not grab you. Okay. I touched. Let you. me ask you a question, Miss Hanks. If I grabbed you by the face right now. Touch me. I don't Go ahead and to. touch me. Sit down. Touch me. I don't want to. Go ahead to. and touch me. I don't want to. You can touch me and it's not going to hurt me. You would feel that it was inappropriate. Uh, no, it would not necessarily because I'm a medical person. You need to touch people when you're a medical person okay. to make but sure I'm that they're okay. Medical attention. You're, you're, you're okay. You're not medical attention. You're needing something. Have a seat over here now. You need to go sit back over there. Nope, I'm sitting here because it's more comfortable and I need my, I need this off. What are you doing? Go yeah. back over there. No, I'm not. You're going to remove my... I'm not. You're not going to remove it until they remove it and find there. out why you brought me here. Go back and sit over no, there. No, I'm sitting right here and it's much more comfortable. This is, this 
is the nurse's station. You can't sit over here. Well, I'm sorry. When they undo my wrists, then I can go back over no, there and sit. I'm not a mean here. person. You need to go back over there, Miss. Hi. My name's Will. Hi, Will. I'm Sarah Hine. I'm a physician assistant. I have a brain tumor. I am in terrible pain. They have been horrendous to me for an hour. Sarah. My name is Will. I'm one of the doctors. I appreciate your PA. I was looking at the glioblastoma multiforme. I know that. But we also, and you know this as somebody who works in medicine, we don't negotiate, right? We can't let you sit at the nursing station. I, okay, I, need I to get ask you to my sit negotiation here, please. is please undo. So again, That's all I, want. I need you to come I'm going to stand. First. Okay, I'm standing there. That's fine. You can I'm stand standing there. I'm not, I will not sit in your place. I'm sorry. I have been through horrendous okay. activity this okay. morning. Okay, I'm just going to try to figure out what's going on. All I'm going to ask is that you stay right here. While All I'm going to ask is that you do my wrist because okay. I have bruises from my wrist. So you're claiming that we beat you up? I am not claiming that you beat me up. I am claiming that you pushed me onto the table, ripped my arms behind my back, and put the wrist on. Can I take some pictures of you to document your injuries? You said you had some bruising and stuff. Well, I when I get in the room, I'm going to take my top off and you're going to see the bruises. Can I take a picture of what I can see right now? You can take a picture of what you see right now. Thank you. I am not a criminal. I did not hit or hurt anybody. I can put them in the front for now. Please put them in the front. When we transport you, we're going to have to put them back in the back, okay? Please put them in the front. But I, I need an assurance from you that you're going to cooperate. I, am, I have given you an insurance for 30 minutes, 45 hour. I will not hurt or... Hey, you will shut my mouth up. All you have to do is just find me in the chair. Don't just charge her with this off. This off. I know whatever she did to you. I didn't do anything. Have a seat. This is the issue that we're having now. Is your do tongue, a thing. I didn't do you're a thing. You're telling me that you're going to complain and stuff, but your actions are something else, okay? I asked you nicely to remove these and fix me. That's not the way I am a nice right. person. I, I, I don't doubt that. We're going to move your handcuffs to the front. I just, like I said, okay? If you, if you act up or do anything wrong, you're going to end up back in handcuffs. I am front. not going to act up, for Christ's sake. I'm an elderly lady. I have a tumor illness. Thank you. Let me see your hand. Turn on. I have to be careful. It hurts. Let me see your hand. I don't dispute, okay, what you're saying, okay? Yeah. Can you loosen this side? Let me see. Okay. Make I'm sorry. I'm not going to hit you. I'm doing range of motion on my shoulders. Okay. Please. It needs to be this way. Okay. Once you get to the jail, you're going to come I don't want to look at you, okay? Just shut me in. I need to be quiet. I'm just not going to look at anybody. I'll be trying to be good. I'm very upset and very frustrated. <laughs> I'm going through hell, and here I am at the jolly, jolly hell. <laughs> Yay me. So proud of my life. Just, the only thing I did was simply ask you to leave. I asked to leave, and I told you I had shortness of breath, and I needed to spend some time packing. It's the guy at the front desk who's being more than rude to you and me. She didn't want to get my doors or anything. Ready, Miss Fine. Ready. Ready for what? We, we gotta go. I will go after I get my pants fastened up. We'll fasten them? I cannot with these on. I need uh, some assistance. Somebody else helped me take them down and did not help me put them back. I didn't see anybody taking your pants off. Well, it doesn't matter, but I will not leave until my pants are fastened, and I do not think that that's unreasonable. Alright. Yeah. Hey, let's put your pants back on. Please, thank you. For, are they in here? Can we shut the door? They, they don't want to see my face. Yeah. So they can shut the door. Okay. Good. I'm going to have to move to the back, okay? Please don't. I have to. It's our Can you make it loose to the back? It hurts so bad. I'll use two sets of cuffs, okay? But it's our policy. Okay. It hurts when this happens. I understand that, but we have to buckle you, okay? I know, because I'm such a mean bitch. Not worth living in the world today. Anyway. What do you say? Well, that's why I'm not. Okay. I'm sorry. I hope this never happens to your mother or your grandmother. You don't have to face the wall. I'll stick my tongue out. You could do that if you want. I can do whatever I want to. I could, but then I'd have to stay here the rest of my life. And you guys would enjoy me so much. Sarah Elizabeth Hine was charged with two counts of assault upon a peace officer.
resisting, evading, or obstructing an officer, and criminal trespass.